All right, guys. That down. Let's move on to this, shall we? So one of the most successful and powerful guys in television is Bill Lawrence. That Bad Monkey show that we were just talking right. about yesterday is has become a huge hit. Uh, of course, Ted Lasso became a global phenomenon, and it looks like we are indeed going to be getting a season four. Uh, he's got a new show he's doing with Steve Carell. And then also he did Scrubs, which was a massively popular show for many years and everybody remembers fondly. Well, they've been talking for years about trying to get a Scrubs reboot or reunion or relaunch of Scrubs, if you will, but there's always been a big problem. Bill Lawrence is now under contract at one studio, but another studio owns the rights to Scrubs. Well, according to this article in Deadline, in an interview with Bill Lawrence, he's saying now they're getting close to coming up with an agreement to allow this to happen. Uh, this is, says this. Uh, I lost the part. There it is. The main obstacles for the Scrubs follow-up has been working out an agreement with Warner Brothers TV where Lawrence is under an exclusive overall deal for him to be able to work on the reboot uh, as Scrubs is produced by Disney's 20th Century Television. Lawrence said this, I think it's getting really close to being figured out, and I think in a good way, Lawrence said. Big chunks of the creative team behind the camera and most of it from in front of the camera are all super invested and excited so very close. Now, who was the what was the guy's name again? The lead guy in Scrubs, Zach Braff. Play, yeah, Zach yeah. Braff played JD. Yep. So Zach Braff has been saying for a long time that they want to get the Scrubs crew back together. He's he said he and the crew from the show all still stay in touch and vacation together and stuff like that. He said they all are ready to do it. They're all ready to come back and do it again. Bill Lawrence has said he wants to do it. The, always the big hang up is Lawrence is under contract at WB, Disney and 20th Century. They own the rights to Scrubs. Right. But it sounds like everybody involved wants to get it done. Mm -hmm. And listen, these revival shows have done pretty damn well in the last number of years. Remember, uh, Will and Grace had its big revival thing. Frasier has ended up being a very successful revival thing. I mean, there's been a couple of misses too, but it seems that, and look, maybe I'm wrong about this. But I think Scrubs is one of those ones. I don't think it would be as popular as it was back in its heyday, but I think it could be a big win. Guys, we want to take a second to thank a sponsor of today's video, Acorns. Hey guys, John here. I want to talk about something that I've been using that really simplifies saving and investing. Acorns. Now, I know a lot of you might find investing intimidating. Maybe you don't know where to start or you think you need a ton of money to make it worthwhile, but trust me, I've been there. And that's why I love Acorns. Acorns makes it super easy to automatically save and invest. And the best part, you can get started with just your spare change, literally. Acorns takes that leftover change from everyday purchases and invests it for you. Acorns builds a portfolio specifically for you based on your money goals, and then it automatically invests your money for you. You don't need to be an expert at all. For me, it was an absolute game changer. When I got started, I was busy. I didn't have time to sit around managing my investments investments, but I still wanted my money to have a chance to grow. Acorns took care of that for me effortlessly. So if you're ready to start investing in your future, head to acorns.com slash campia or download the Acorns app to start today. Client testimonial. Compensation provides incentive to positively promote Acorns. Investing involves risk. Acorns Advisors, LLC, and SEC Registered Investment Advisor. View important disclosures at acorns.com slash campia. I think so. Now, I, ironically, Laura and I have been binging Scrubs on Peacock. We're on season five. Nice. Yeah. Because we, we both, before we even knew each other, we both followed the show when it first had aired. You know so I mean? you've seen the original series. I've seen it all through. Let yeah. me ask you this. Did you watch season nine? Yes, and I never will again. Okay, so for So those... when I recommend people, I always say it's one through eight. Forget nine. Yeah. Like, because eight was supposed to be it. He had his final walk through the hallway. Oh. It was so... That was such a touching scene. It, and where they where he looked at a movie screen yep. of a montage of what his future was going to be mm -hmm. like, played to the music of Peter Gabriel's Book of Love. Yep. It was in, in in an industry, television shows have a very, very difficult time sticking the landing with their finales. It was a great finale. And then a new deal got struck, and I think it changed networks, didn't it? I think it changed it networks. It may have. Anyway, then they did a season nine Ugh. 
but a couple of the key characters, including Zach Braff himself, weren't a part of it, and right. it was just awful. Yeah, it was so, like a it was like a med school kind of thing. It was, yeah, something like it, that. It, where, felt, it felt like it felt like uh, Saved by the Bell, the, the new class, is what it felt like. Yes, worse though. <laughs> Not that Saved by the Bell was as good as Scrubs, but I'm just saying. Worse though, <laughs> it was so bad. And again, especially when you go back and look at the finale of season eight. I get. I got emotional. He's mm -hmm. standing out in the back of the hospital. He's outside. Yeah. And he sees in his mind's eye this movie screen, and the future that you know him and the girl get married, and the, the him and his best friend they both get, have kids, and the growing up together, yeah. and family life. He's just. But it and was so beautiful. Preceding that too, didn't he see like all of his patients too? Like a lot of the patients that had been through the years. Oh, I can't remember. I feel like that was part of it too. I, it's possible. It was and a like, big send off. Like it talk was. about a, a season finale done right or series finale done right. Yeah, especially when you're coming off things like the, like the Seinfeld finale yeah. and all that kind of stuff, and even like the Cheers finale wasn't very good. But no, but it was so well done. And if they can bring it back, I really do hope they just ignore that season nine ever existed. I hope they just pretend like it didn't. Yeah. But who knows? We'll see, guys. Question is for you. What do you think about this? Bill Lawrence is saying it it looks like it's going to happen. It Because it, all the people behind the scenes on it want it to happen. The cast is all down for it. And it looks like WB and Disney might be getting close to making an agreement to how to make this thing work. Would you be interested in a Scrubs revival? I certainly will be. Whatever you guys think, jump down to the comments section below and let us know your thoughts.